It's another week of as the world turns for the UL quarterback situation. True freshman Levi Lewis got the start versus Georgia Southern Saturday, but was eventually replaced by junior Jordan Davis for the rest of the game. Now, as reporter Mike Carter tells us, the decision of who will get the nod at QB looms large with the season in the balance. Due to inconsistent play from the Cajuns' three starting quarterbacks this season, Cajuns head coach Mark Hudspeth says the team will enter its final regular season week of practice with Saturday's starter against App State still very much undecided. Well, we're going to evaluate that uh, today and tomorrow. You know, uh, Levi, you know, uh, came in and, and just we didn't really get off the ground offensively. I think we had three straight three and outs, and, uh, and they already had got up 14 points. And so we were just to the point uh, with that interception. We gave them the short field. We had to have a spark, and I'll give Jordan credit. I thought Jordan did some really nice things. We were, we were looking to play Levi here in the second half of the season. Um, and like I said, he's done some really good things, played well, obviously. And then he didn't get to play because of injury in that one game. And then we gave him this opportunity this past week. And, and really, like I said, got off to a little bit of a slow start. But the guy is such a competitor. Both guys are very capable. Um, and both guys are really both deserving to play because they've both done some good things. We're going to probably make that decision before practice Tuesday so we start getting one of the two ready. There's an old adage that says if you have two quarterbacks, you have no quarterback. Well, for the Cajuns, you can make that three. But Hudspeth believes the competition has been good for his team and that all three starters have supported each other all season. That being said, Hudspeth says the team will look to ride the hot hand of whoever stands out at practice this week, with UL needing a win at App State to become bowl eligible. With the Cajuns, Mike Carter, KETC Sports.